What you can learn with the 8 most stressful cities in the world. Traffic. Violence. Skyrocketing rental prices. The term urban stress acquires a new meaning in those cities. 2011. I am a trainee at a global energy trader leaving the office at 18.30. Just an ordinary day, in ordinary life. I walk to the parking lot, where my Chevrolet Corsa waits for me. The air is damp, and a water droplet touches my nose. Another hits my eyebrow, and a third one lands just above my lip. It is raining? A refreshing, mild drizzle in a subtropical city, cleaning the air, washing the streets. The smell of wet grass excites my nose. What an enjoyable feeling. But I remember that this is Sao Paulo. Almost 22 million people live here, cramped in less than 8,000 square kilometers. It is almost the entire population of Australia, in an area smaller than Puerto Rico. In Sao Paulo, these delicate, soothing droplets are a prelude to chaos. The Metropolitan Problem Sao Paulo is no different from hundreds of other megacities. They are stressful, densely populated, polluted, and often violent. A small disturbance like rainfall can unleash havoc and make you waste hours in traffic. Why people are still attracted to them? The usual answer is better salaries. But even the clearest benefit has a dark face, the higher salaries also result in higher living costs, forcing common people to live in cubicles if they want to build their savings and escape from the metropolis. Days ago, I found a surprising ranking about urban stress. Sao Paulo and other cities I lived in, Doha, Warsaw, Santiago were all similar in terms of how stressful they are. This made me curious to understand more about the most stressful cities in the world, and in this article, I will present to you what I found. To build the ranking of the most stressful cities in the world, the international company VAE used a method considering indicators as governance, safety, security, stability, etc. Demographic and geographic factors, people slash KM2, traffic, weather, air slash noise slash light pollution. Finance, unemployment rate, living costs versus wages, social security, etc. Public health services. From my experience of visiting some of these cities, I could only agree with the results. Before starting the ranking, a small favor I would like to ask, if you like this video, please hit the like button and the subscribe button so YouTube keep showing it. Now time to begin the list of the most stressful cities in the world. 8th most stressful city in the world, Karachi, Pakistan. Karachi had decent results in things like traffic, weather, or financial stress. The city also has a relatively low cost of living even considering the local income. But dreadful scores in noise pollution, it is curious how it has a low traffic index but high noise pollution at the same time. Maybe the few drivers are using their honks too frequently, health services and political stability put the largest city of Pakistan among the eight most stressful cities in the world. Karachi's total score, from 0 to 100, 36.6. 7th most stressful city in the world, Moscow, Russia. Among the 8 most stressful cities in the world, Moscow is the only one in a country with a high human development index, HDI greater than 0 0.800. It is also the only city not in Asia, or Africa. To make the Russian capital presence in this list even more peculiar, it scored excellent results in factors like air pollution, the city has plenty of green areas and industrial parks are far from residential zones. The average salary in Moscow is also far higher than any other among the eight most stressful cities in the world, at $1,600 per month, it is over 300% of the average wage in Karachi, for example. Unemployment is only 3.6%, Lagos, in Nigeria, has it 10 times worse. 
So how Moscow came to be one of the eight most stressful large cities in the world? The explanation is in three indicators where the Russian capital had terrible results. First, Moscow had the worst result of all the cities surveyed in vehicle traffic. The score varies between 1 and 100, and the Russian metropolis scored 1. According to the Moscow Times, the city has the worst traffic jams on the planet. Second, financial stress. Moscow has an average salary far higher than the rest of Russia. But the living costs skyrocketed, and land prices became prohibitive in many areas. In some streets, there is no real estate available for less than $22 million. Third, weather. The indicator considers the optimal conditions for human life. We are talking about a city with short but scorching summers and freezing and dark winters. Further explanations are unnecessary. Moscow's total score, from 0 to 100, 36.1. Sixth most stressful city in the world, Kabul, Afghanistan. Afghanistan is in the middle of a civil war, and the current government and Taliban dispute its capital. This is enough to understand why Kabul had the lowest results possible, one on a scale between 1 and 100, in safety and security and social and political stability. It also had the minimum score in healthcare access. Kabul is not in an even worse position thanks to the mild climate and the low living costs. Kabul's total score, from 0 to 100, 34.3. Fifth most stressful city in the world, Baghdad, Iraq. While Baghdad is not as dangerous as Kabul, it is still in an unstable region marked by conflict. Put in the equation the dry weather and the scarce natural resources to comprehend why the Iraq capital is among the five most stressful cities in the world. Surprisingly, however, Baghdad has better healthcare services than most of the cities on this list. Baghdad's total score, from 0 to 100, 31.7. Fourth most stressful city in the world, New Delhi, India. Videos and photos of reddened, dusty skies over Indian megacities are oft a topic of discussion about how progress can burden the environment. New Delhi had the worst possible scores in air pollution and social security, and one of the worst results in car traffic. New Delhi's total score, from 0 to 100, 31.5. Third most stressful city in the world, Manila, Philippines. On the positive side, Manila had the best score on this list, and one of the best overall, in mental health. Years ago, while in Qatar, I worked with many Filipinos. They have an optimistic approach, even when facing natural disasters or economic difficulties. I would bet that this approach contributes to their good score in mental health. But Manila got the third place among the most stressful cities in the world because of a terrible result in traffic, 3.3 on a scale from 1 to 100, plus negative results in safety, pollution, and weather, to be in the center of a typhoon zone does not help is also the most densely populated city on this list, over 20,000 people per square slash km. Manila's total score, from 0 to 100, 29.4. Second most stressful city in the world, Lagos, Nigeria. Lagos had the worst possible result in noise pollution, plus a single digit score, on a scale that goes to 100, in healthcare access. It likewise performed poorly in safety, social and political stability, and unemployment. 37% of the population does not have a job. Lagos total score, from 0 to 100, 19.9. First most stressful city in the world, Mumbai, India. Mumbai is the seventh largest city in the world. It is also one of the most polluted, it has some of the worst traffic jams, has skies covered in pollution, is subject to floods, and has high living costs compared to the national income levels. If all that is not enough, 
it had the minimal score in Social Security. Mumbai total score, from 0 to 100, 1.